Biodiesel is the current growing and renewable resource for fuel, mostly used in vehicles as an alternative energy source to oil and natural gas. You can make bottle fuel yourself in a lab with a simple procedure. The materials you will need are a 2 liter plastic bottle, 1 liter of canola oil, a hot plate, a thermometer, sodium hydroxide, methanol, scupula, a funnel, a 501 liter beaker, and a scale. First off, use your scupula to measure up 4 grams on the scale of sodium hydroxide and put 250 milliliters of methanol into the 500 milliliter beaker. Dissolve the 4 grams of sodium hydroxide into the 250 milliliters of methanol and mix with scupula until dissolved completely. This process takes approximately 10 to 15 minutes. Measure out 1 liter of canola oil into the 1 liter beaker and set on hot plate at high. Use the thermometer by putting it in the canola oil and waiting for it to reach a high temperature of 50 to 55 degrees Celsius before removing. By opening the plastic bottle and using the funnel, pour the hot canola oil into the 2 liter plastic bottle. After all the oil is in the bottle, pour the dissolved mixture of sodium hydroxide and methanol, known as methoxide, into the 2 liter bottle. Put the lid onto the bottle and shake vigorously for about 20 to 30 seconds. Let the mixture settle for 10 minutes and repeat the shaking and settling process twice again. After the process is done, let the mixture settle once for 10 minutes and continue the first wash. At this point, your biofuel should have a layer of glycerin at the bottom of the plastic bottle, which can be easily removed since it's waste. This process involves you using a clean 1 liter beaker and removing the clear biofuel from the plastic bottle into the beaker and dumping out the waste glycerin in the sink, then washing the bottle. Afterwards, pour the biofuel back into the plastic bottle and add 500 milliliters of water. Rotate the bottle slowly, very, very slowly, 360 degrees, and let it settle for 10 minutes. Repeat the slow repeat rotating process and let it settle again for 10 minutes. After the 10 minutes is complete, shake the bottle vigorously again for 20 to 30 seconds and let it settle over a period of a time of about 2 weeks. After the 2 weeks is complete, your biofuel should now have a clear yellowish liquid above a cloudy white layer inside your plastic bottle. At this process, remove your clear yellowish liquid into a mason jar, allowing none of the white cloudy layer to flow into the mason jar. And there you have it, your own personal biofuel. You may use this as you wish.